Throwing a Halloween party or entertaining guests during the holidays is a lot of fun, but it can also be a little bit of stress when it comes to entertaining guests. Mm -hmm. So the team at Ladies Home Journal taste tested some store-bought frozen appetizers here with the best of the best food and entertaining editor, Tara Bench. Tara, good to see you. Good to see you guys. And we're throwing a pretty banging party yes. in here ourselves. Cocktail so party at I what like is what's it? Happening. 11 a.m. <laughs> yeah, it's early. Before noon. So uh, some people think frozen appetizer and eh, I shouldn't do it but there's Cheating. so many options right out there now. you think you have to buy all the ingredients and make the little bites and keep them ready and hot but frozen appetizers have obviously come a long way they're really delicious there's so many options out there and affordable so and you sampled all of them we're gonna sample we them did. as well let's bring out our first tray Bianca come on out she's got the beef and pork tray oh, Bianca. Okay. all right now these are from I guess they have everyone's favorites my favorite right here pigs in a blanket yes right? so they're Trader Joe's Parmesan wow. puppies Ooh, those puppies. are fancy great so they're they're very tasty. Dip so pigs in, in a blanket are some of the most popular okay. cocktail and this, appetizers. And this is a pork and vegetable pot sticker from Whole Foods, right? Yes. So mm. all of these, now the pot stickers especially, mm. you can get your own sauces and dip, keep dips around. Um, one of the keys to a nice cocktail party with these little appetizers oh, okay. is to put plates all around the house right. so that people are mingling. So there's not one big food hub that everyone gets and Lots of little on. napkins too. Yes, exactly. Okay. These can be pretty filling, though, so you do want to kind of keep the trays coming, but sporadically, right? Yeah, and exactly. And some are bigger sizes, um, smaller and sizes. And the nice thing is, one to two bites. You've all Thank been you. at a cocktail party. Thanks. Thanks. Okay. okay, so what do we have chicken here? Chicken choices here. So okay. these are mandarin orange chicken bites. Oh, look at that. These are right here? Yes. Okay. And where are these from? These are... Oh, let's see. I've got yep, it here. Yep, you've mandarin got it. orange chicken bites Whole from a tandoori chicken samosas from Whole Foods. Yes. Yep. So all over. I mean, you've got a variety of choices wherever you shop, mm. wherever you go. They're kind of that Asian flavor, but they're easy to eat. Um, they come with the sauce in mm -hmm. the package, really easy. But you can always supplement it with your favorite sauce. So the and samosa the was one of our editor's favorites. It has just enough spice, and there's a lot of layers of flavor. So you just... It takes a lot of time to get that at home, right, if you're mm -hmm. making your own appetizers, but these are great. They stay crispy. You and can keep them warm in the toaster oven or in a low right, oven. Right, very easy to heat up. Mm -hmm. Now, these are, is this the vegetarian selection? And important to have a vegetarian tray, too, right? It is, too, and there's right? a lot of options. There's, uh, these are caramelized onion and feta bites. With these are from Trader, Trader Joe's. Yes, yep. such a nice puff pastry. And they're really light, Ooh, but kind nice. of oh, indulgent that. at the same mm -hmm. time. So, not too sweet. Really that's nice okay. and crazy. What are we talking all these price wise? They're not crazy expensive. So are you've they? got a range. You can get little boxes of them mm -hmm. for two to three dollars up to ten to twelve dollars mm -hmm. for some of the nicer seafood ones. We have a lobster one coming out in a minute. But really affordable. The nice thing is you can keep them in your freezer right. and just pull out whatever you need right. or get them for a big party. And more and more people are becoming vegetarian or even gluten free. Mm -hmm. So that brings us to some of the other options we mm -hmm. have here. Thank seafood, you again, right? Allie. More seafood. Yes, here. So we have our lobster and cheese bites oh. here. Okay. And then the coconut shrimp, which is always a huge hit. Coconut shrimp is one of the most popular, and these are both from, well, coconut shrimp is from CPAC. And these are Archer Farms. The Archer Farms, which is Target. So you know they're affordable. You know they're easy they to get. Great. They are. They're really decadent and indulgent. You just need one or two. And I think we have some spring rolls that kind of bring the seafood so Asian already, flavors really together like, as well. Huh? Yeah, we'll taste, taste those, those in a minute. Wow. So all of these, Delicious. you notice, you don't need a knife or a fork. Have you ever been to a cocktail party and you're trying to hold your drink? And, and then you're holding the plate and you've yeah. got it. Yeah, yes. so this is so these are food. perfect. Um, so these are spring rolls. Also one Come of on, the Willie. things. Yeah, yeah. Taste them, taste them. Here. Another one that comes with the sauce, which is really nice because it comes in the package. What are you guys talking about back there, guys? Huh? Mm -hmm. and how how come you have the real amazing. drinks and we have the water? What is that about? <laughs> More importantly, that bring a your drink. Party. <laughs> what kind of party Let's is crank this? Crank this party up a little bit. I know. That's all the right. other thing. These all go with beer, wine, cocktails, any type of party. Very have. easy awesome. to do. Nice, nice little appetizer. Yeah, Tara thank Bench, you. thank you so much. Thanks. Coming up next, breaking up is hard to do, especially if it's with a credit card company or a bank. We've got some tips to help you move on without all the aggravation. That's right after this. Thank you.